Hello and welcome again to the Axe Attic. Now I haven't been able to do any gear demos still because of not having the equipment so I thought I might explore single coil pickups and their anatomy really. Um, so this is just you know standard single coil pickup. These two came in a Kramer guitar um, I can't quite remember the name. Oh yeah, it was a Focus from the Music Yo era. So, um, although some of the guitars from the Music Yo era were great, such as the one I'm sitting next to right now, um, this one really wasn't that great. Um, it was about sixty dollars, I think, originally in the U.S. Uh, so, you know, the quality on that wasn't that great. So, you know, I have these pickups left over, you know, after disassembling it completely. And, um, I thought I might explore them a bit. So, here is a completely assembled pickup. Um, just, you know, cheap, standard. So you can see the bob in here. The slugs or pole pieces, whatever you want to call them. The just the tape and the magnet and so this is I'm not sure, hang on let me find something magnetic um, let's see I can't see anything immediately around me um, I'll just have a look if this tin works. You see? Magnetic. And now I'm going to look at one that's been fully opened up so it's not just the cover that's been removed. So here it is. Now we take the cover off and you can see I have actually removed the tape. And so you can see the coil of wire here that's I believe copper and it's got, and I believe, weirdly enough, it's been wax potted, which I wouldn't expect on something of, you know, that cheap, not very high build quality guitar. And, you know, the slugs and pole pieces and whatever. And so you can see these are actually directly wrapped around um, the slugs or pole pieces. And unfortunately, this wasn't a great quality pickup, so the magnet has just kind of fallen off before. So you can actually see from the bottom, you know, it's actually a pretty simple construction. And here are the wires. Um, one is connecting to one side of the coil and the other is, yeah, connected to the other. Wow. <laughs> and so I'm just going to prove the point of this being fundamental to the pickup's construction because when this is next to, when this is with this you see nothing um, however get the magnet oh, going everywhere um, there we go so that's the uh, general anatomy of a single coil pickup. Now if if it's a possibility, I will um, try and record a video showing how that actually, just proving the point generally of um, the magnet being essential. Um, but for now, you know, I'll be cynical about it. So yeah, I don't think I'll be able to if I haven't got an output jack lying about but I'll see anyway um, thank you for watching this and yeah that's really about it goodbye okay um, I'm back and it turns out I do have an output jack which is right there and so uh, I'm going to demonstrate the single coil pickup with the use of the magnet so it's currently got the magnet um, on the back so we're just going to 
rub this pick tin against it, which is magnetic. Well, you know, it does. It is attracted by magnets. And so I'll show you. I put the reverb on to just uh, make sure that you can tell the sound of the actual um, vibration against the sound of the amp. So you can hear. There is definitely, you know, quite a big sound coming from that. However, remove this. Oh, okay, it wants to follow. It still works, but I think it sounds a bit different. So the output has changed, so the magnet adds the output, well, you know, it increases the output. So that is the role of the magnet in a single coil pickup. Um, I hope you have found this video somewhat useful. Uh, yeah, again, thank you for watching. <laughs>